Hi everyone, today we are going to discuss about creating a purchase order with different functionalities in IFS ERP with minimum steps. So, first, we'll see how we can create a purchase order template. We can use purchase order template for a given supplier when we are creating a purchase order repetitively. It means if we are creating same purchase order over and over, we can create a purchase order template and we can use this template when we are creating purchase order. So we'll see how we can create a purchase order. First, we have to click on create new and provide purchase order template. I'm going to give purchase order template ID one and description electronic parts and we have to select a supplier from the drop down and we have to select the relevant site as well and save the record now we can add purchase parts from this window you can add one by one part or we can add multiple parts at once so now i'm going to add multiple parts since we have selected our supplier, the system will list down all the registered parts for the given supplier. We can select whatever the items from the supplier and add required quantities. 15 laptops, 40 laptops, 12 10 keyboards. And I'm going to save the record by clicking on OK. Now my purchase order template record is ready to be used. We'll see how we can incorporate this purchase order template with the purchase order. We can go to quick purchase order registration window and we have to select our supplier. And I'm selecting my supplier. Then the next step is click next and in here we can add part one by one or add multiple parts at once or add from a template from order. In this scenario I am going to add part using a template so I am clicking on this add from template. From this template id drop down I am providing my template ID. It's one one one. And in this window, we can remove unnecessary part for the purchase order. If I don't want this pointer, I can select the part and delete from the purchase order, but it won't delete from the original template. So. Now I am click OK, then all the remaining four parts will be added to purchase order. From this edit button, you can change the quantities required and click on done button. And we can finish this purchase order registration by clicking on finish button. If you want to see the purchase order which has been created in this scenario, you know, click yes and click on detail button. Then your created purchase order is now ready to be used. The next thing that we are going to discuss is how we can copy a purchase order and create the purchase order using quick purchase order. So now I am going to copy this purchase order number and we'll see how we can copy the purchase order and create a purchase order. In here also we have to select our 
layer and click next and I am going to add parts from the order so I am providing my order number here and click ok and I need all four items for my purchase order then I am clicking ok if I want more items I can add it from here as well If I want to change other line items, I can change like this way and click done. And the next step is to finish the purchase order registration process. And we can see the created purchase order as the fine. We'll see how we can duplicate the purchase order using this interface by click on this duplicate icon we can duplicate a purchase order when we are clicking on this duplicate icon it will duplicate all the header line items from the previous purchase order and the next step is to save the header now we can add relevant part lines to the purchase order we can add it one by one manually or we can add it using a purchase order template now I'm going to add lines using a template so this is the template I have recently created and I don't need these two items so I'm going to delete and now I want these three items and I click on OK and I'm going to edit my purchase order quantities as follows and click on save now my purchase order is ready I hope you got how we can create a purchase order with minimum steps when we are having repetitive purchase orders for a given supplier thank you for watching us